slash early afternoon i've had a somewhat productive morning see me psychologist and we had a good chat um although i was five minutes late because i slept through me alarms even though it didn't look like i was in a rush at the start of this video i was but i was determined to record i want to make today a, a good productive positive one i'm sick of the negativity um i want to have a bit of an uplifting day um, after having a very rough one yesterday, it was very full of depression and uh, difficulties. So I want to I wanna do good today. I want to go out for a walk because it's been a couple of days since I've been outside, I think. Um, although that isn't a very long time, but I, I want to try and get out and get some exercise and breathe back fresh air. Um, to make this day a better one than yesterday um, I want to try and get out of my car, in my car but it, if I can't I want to at least um, start it up because it's been at least a month since I've actually been in it and started it and it's freezing cold outside so um, I don't want my car to get knocked in or anything you know um, so there me goals for today I want to make it a, a cushy one, you know. I'm sick of. I'm sick of the suffering, so I'm gonna try and live in the moment a bit a day, um, as much as I possibly can, um, and just do things and end the day feeling a bit a bit accomplished, you know. It might not look like much, but I'm just gonna have a chill one, a chill good one, you know. Hopefully. <laughs> so you can see it's a bit dull out there, but hey ho, I'm looking forward to going outside soon. Currently just chilling watching The Walking Dead. I'm sick of staring at screens all the time, so I've decided just to sit here and stare out my window at the rather dull, but still somewhat light sky. Um, helps us, you know, chill a bit instead of overstimulating my brain <laughs> with constant watching TV or, I don't know, staring at my PlayStation screen because I don't know what else to do. <coughs> I'm going to venture outside soon as well. Um, I think it's like 3 o'clock at the minute. Sun, sunset. Yeah, sunset. <laughs> Is that... Uh, in about an hour or so, so it's starting to get less light. Um, yeah, my brain's uh, making us a bit dumb when I, when I get like this, I don't know. 
I feel like I'm slowly losing my brain cells sometimes and you're just trying engage my brain as much as possible but I don't know how to do it um, doing this helps this helps keep your brain ticking yeah I need some fresh air There's loads of people out today and I know my hair's crazy. I really need a haircut. That's on my list of things to do, but right now I'm just trying to take and be out here. That was breath, but <laughs> it's all right. It's going all right. Bit too many people about, but I'm not gonna lie. But these trees, these trees are my favorite. Um, yeah, I just walk around the cemetery. I know it's a bit dreary walking around the cemetery, but it's very close next to where I live. Um, and it's just nice and peaceful. That's why I love it. <laughs> this is where I go every time I go out for a walk. There's a park nearby as well, but I never really go there it's too far. <laughs> but um, I know I'm chatting pure crap right now, but I'm trying to focus on sunset. So nice. I can actually see through this hair as well, which is crazy. I can see. That's a better view of it. You can hear the birds as well. This is why I love being out here. run off for a little bit but I need to take her off for a proper spin soon that'll be in another video I think when I go to the hairdresser I'm back in the warmth happy to be back inside but glad I managed to venture out and start my car up can you tell I'm a little bit sleepy it's starting to get really dark no shit since I just showed you the sunset I say the most obvious things sometimes, but right now I could be beating myself up about not going out in my car. If it was a bad day, I think I would have been. I would have been pissed off with myself for, for not going for a drive and for feeling a bit too anxious to do it. Um, but today is not that day. Um, I'm feeling, I'm telling myself, and, and I do believe this, that I'm happy I went in the car, I turned it on, started it up just so I know it's alright, the battery isn't dead and stuff like that. So I've done it. I wanted to do it and I've done it. Been out for a walk, that's a good thing. I know it feels like in the, it is basic stuff but I'm still happy I've done it. <laughs> and I could be pissed off that I spilled one of my chocolate drinks on my bed and it looks like I shit my bed. But I'm not. Um, Maybe that's what I want you to think, you know. <laughs> nah, really, it is a chocolate drink. <laughs> um, but that's okay, I'll change the sheets and that'll be sorted. Um, so today has been, and it continues to be a, a chilled one. Probably one of the best days I've had in a while. Like, I don't know, I just felt, I woke up feeling... Frantic at first that I had slept, slept through me alarms and I had everyone rush to me online psychologist appointment but other than that like, I, I feel quite accomplished and serene today. Um, yes everything's still the same mental, mental health wise in terms of the, you know what I was going about, I don't even want to mention it um, but I'm here and I'm doing these things. And I'm okay. I'm okay.
this is one of my favorite things to do. Lie in bed. Chill. I think being unconscious asleep is the only time the nervous system ever really gets a break. <laughs> um, and like right when I wake up on the morning, mainly after me when I wake up, but I feel just very as calm as I can possibly be when I wake up, you know, like it's very peaceful. Um, I guess that's why I like sleep so much. And if I wake up in the morning, I'll open my eyes and I'll be like, screw this, I want to go back to sleep because I want to be unconscious again. And just that nice comfort and feeling of like passing out again, you know. I think everyone has that. I'm not trying to be dramatic or anything, just I really like sleep. <laughs> uh, I was just thinking about that, I know it's quite random, but I'm just sitting here watching the football, nice and cosy, ignoring me, vision. I'm still taking these bad boys every night. Magnesium gummies. Because I'm crap at swallowing pills. The OCD always makes us check each gummy before I chew and swallow it. And I have to check it over and over again. Mainly to see if there's any of the uh, tin foil on it. And I know for a fact there isn't any on it, but I have to give it a good, good stare. Otherwise, I won't be able to eat it in peace, you know. It's part of the life. Up next is a vitamin D. Zoned out for a second there. <laughs> um. I take these after I've ate my soup because I just had my soup and that's probably the highest thing in fat that I eat during the day so vitamin D is more readily absorbed when you've got fat in your stomach so that's why I do that. This takes us forever to swallow these as well. I only swallow one but I'm very inconsistent at swallowing. Successfully swallowed. Something that I say to myself a lot is that the goal of life as a human is to get through every day ending up in your bed at night to sleep. And that's how you know you've successfully been a human for the day because you've survived another day. That's that's all the goal of a human really is, to survive a day, to not die. And as long as you don't die during a the day, then you've successfully humaned. That's how I tell myself I've succeeded. So, so far... Touch wood, there's no wood around, but so far I haven't died yet. <laughs> and it's like 91 a.m., so I think that's another day I can take off and say I should wake up tomorrow, you know? Um, <laughs> honestly, that is something I do tell myself, but it's um, not something I didn't, I thought of until I read. I, I can't remember where I read it, but I read it somewhere. Um, I thought it was a good outlook on things. Um, it helps us, I guess, rationalise my existence. and Yeah, I don't know. I just thought I'd share it. I still haven't even took my metazapine yet. I don't take that until 2am most of the time. Um, mainly because I've 
eat a lot in the night time and I don't want to take it too early because I fall asleep before I can eat enough so um because it, it does knock us out like an hour and a half to two hours after taking it so um if I take it at two I can just go to sleep that really anyway so I took me there not too long ago and I'm ready for unconsciousness, so good night. Thank you for watching.